Hello? Hello, hello, hello. Hey, listen, there's an osprey up here, and I'm still thinking that it's possible that it's, uh, it's my friend. It's the one I rescued. Uh, the other week, the other month, I came out here in the morning, and I saw a bird uh, who looked like he was having some problems in the water. Another one was circling. I now believe that the other one circling was the mother trying to help. You really can't help. So I got on the paddleboard and I went out to get it, not really thinking about what I was going to do. But when I got, this is a bird of prey. And as I got closer, uh, it came over to me. I uh, put the oar down because it couldn't get up. And then when it got on the paddleboard, I'm looking at these sharp talons and this sharp thing and these bloodshot red orange monkey eyes <laughs> that it's a bird of prey. And by survival mode, I was waiting for it to tell me that I need to get down now. So every time I lifted the oar up, every time I lifted the paddle, it was kind of fidgety and kind of scared. So. I talked to it and sang to it. Yeah, there's you. one point that I sang to Just it. Don't fly away. You could injure me. Yeah. So anyway, he, uh, I got him to the side, I'm gonna help and out. he dried off, and he flew away. But I still believe that, uh, okay. I don't know, one day he's going to fly down and sit next to me and say thanks. Hey Siri, what's the date today? It's Sunday, the 13th of June, okay. 2019. Hey Siri, how many days until September 1st? It's 63 days until then. Okay. All right, I have 63 more days, 63 more days. I did this last year for the trip and that was, I, I have been saving change all year long. Last year I think it was $300 I ended up with. Uh, yeah, so. I feel like, maybe not. I feel like this is less, I'm not sure. So I did a real fun feature last year, and that was the buy me a coffee link, which you can find in the description below. I'm, I'm gathering up uh, money, I'm gathering up donations, I'm gathering up things because when I go to the Greek islands this, this year, I'm not just showing up and taking, I'm going to give, I'm gonna contribute. And I'm working on visiting a donkey and a doggy sanctuary. And I want to give them a nice gift. I want to give them a nice donation. I want to make them some nice content. I want to make some awareness to this type of animal rescue. I think what I can scratch up is obviously a generous donation for people that rely on anything. But what if I put the buy me a coffee link down below and for the next 60 something days, I can take that and also contribute. And if you trust the idea of what I've researched and what I've vetted, uh, it's gonna be good. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be good. So anyway, if you want to, check the description below. And I'm really excited that I get to uh, be a little hands-on. Yeah, a little hands-on and go to a place that I know these animals, although cared for, although protected, can use the support and the resources, the care and the funding and the donations of people. And through this, the awareness. Hello, hello. Do you remember when I was on the island of Skiathos last year, I learned that even though I was driving that morning on another island, I could not rent a car on that island because I needed an international driver's license. The Greece government has cracked down and they now require an international driver's license. All right, so since coming to this island, I've learned that they're not gonna rent me a vehicle. And he said he couldn't rent it to me. I didn't have an international driver's license, which I've never needed before. Anyway, I returned later that summer and I rented cars all along the different islands.
to Zakynthos. And on Zakynthos, I don't know what really happened, but I lost my international driver's license. There you go. My friend, my friend, what do you got for me? It barely seemed like an official document to begin with. I need another one, and it becomes, it begins with a profile picture. If I had to start over, let's go get a passport photo. Anyway, I tried to look respectable for this. You know, I just probably got some good news about that house. This is not the finish line, but I've had such bad news that I'll take any news that feels positive. <sighs> Trying to get the spider webs off me, y'all. Spider webs! Come on, we got some more to go to. I need another international driver's license. Very good, very good. I am incrementally taking care of my life. What's that mean? One problem at a time. I'm not leaving anytime soon, but this is something I no longer have to worry about. 20 bucks. Thanks, AAA. I believe I mentioned in the last video that I have an idea that instead of traveling the Greek islands with a skateboard, I would like to travel with my paddleboard. 10 feet. Oh, yeah, be careful, careful. Hey, you, be careful. You need to be careful. Okay, jump down. Jump down, brave baby. Yeah, it's 10 feet, but the deal with this is it is inflatable and it is collapsible and it could be travelable. Okay. And uh, anyway, so let's do something. Hey, Siri. Set, mm, set a stopwatch. Anyway, it's gonna give me a, a, a realistic time of how long it actually takes to uh, take the air out, how long it takes to inflate, and how easily does it roll up? How small, how come, how come, pack? All right, so what happened? <laughs> I do have another idea, but the jury is not out as of now. Meepaw, please don't roll in the duck poo. Come here, get over here. Meepaw, come here. Hey Siri, what does my stopwatch say? Eight minutes. Eight minutes, the air's out. Pleasantly surprised. I'm not sold on the idea, but this is about 18 to 20 pounds. The paddle, the uh, oar is collapsible, thin. I absolutely could put this in a duffel bag. I can actually put this in its own piece of luggage. <laughs> Experiment successful. Verdict, not in. Come on, get up here. I know. You're okay. It's okay. La, 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 la. Somebody was gonna hurt you. I'm gonna help you out. Stay. He's afraid of the paddle. It's okay. <laughs>